there are movements that are that are risky, but only if you're not doing them correctly. You know, and again, that comes down to coaching and good coaching. Um, everything's risky, though. You know, you can go to the gym normally. You can go for a run. You can go canoeing. You can whatever you want to do for your fitness. Everything's pretty dangerous. You know, you can fall off your bike. You can, you know, capsize in a canoe. You can do lots of different things are dangerous, right? Um, I would say that CrossFit's safe. Uh, as long as you've got good coaches. You know, we, we are super strict here on making sure that um, the weights that people use are only up to a certain level in terms of the technique allows. Um, we take everybody through a weekend course ourselves um, before they even come into class. Um, and I think it's just a case of being sensible with people, you know? Um, it's, as, it's as dangerous as any other sport out there. The only disadvantage really I find is, is trying to hold people back sometimes, you know, they, they want to they wanna come in here and be Rich Froning or be Sam Briggs, be the top people um, in the world and that's up to a coach to, to slow people down and to make sure that they get the basics right and step by step build up slowly. That can be a disadvantage in the sense that they see all these all, it's a huge look list, it's a huge media success. It's all over YouTube, social media, and I think sometimes people come in and expect to be the next big thing. Which, you know, it's been it's been a kind of caught the social media boom, caught it at the right time. Um, the CrossFit Games, the, the big world championships they have each year, that's had a big effect on it as well. You know, helping helping uh, create a um, a sport out of it, which has been appealing. It's a spectator sport, and people will go and watch, which which grows the sport. Um, but overall, I just think it's 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 the first fitness practice that's brought everything together and gone. You know what? Um, let's specialise in not specialising. Let's do different things every day. Let's test the body in different ways. Let's learn new skills. Let's eat well, and let's have a community where we all support each other. We're all friends and we want everybody, as much as you're, you want to beat the person next to you in the workout of the day, you also want them to do really well. And, and, and I think that community ethos and that whole thing is, um, is a great thing uh, to have and um, I'm really, really happy and proud to be part of it.